1954 Chevrolet Bel Air two door that just came into unique, especially in classics here. This particular car, as you see, it is Bermuda green and Fiesta cream. That is the way that this car would have came from Chevrolet, according to the data tag and the paint trim on it. It also would have had the dark green, light green cloth vinyl interior combination. Still the way it appears now as far as color wise. Powered by an inline six, 235 cubic inch engine. That's what you would have got when you got the automatic transmission that this car also has. So bench seat up front, shift on the column. Uh, also has power steering as an option. As you can see, it's riding on a kind of a chrome rally style wheel with wheel cover. Nice looking car. This particular car, we actually had him before, sold it once. Uh, folks kept it for a while and drive them like they do. And then eventually they might want a different car, or change it up a little bit. So we traded it back in since we knew the car. Great running car. This thing fires off with the turn of a key just instantly. Uh, if you'd like to check out the undersides, you can see the interior um, engine bay trunk. Check out the still pictures. If you look down below this video in the description, there's a link you can click on. That'll take you to uniqueclassiccars.com. Feel free to call us too, 507-386-1726. Be happy to help you out with it. As you can see, the chrome and the bright work is nice in the car. The paint does show its age a little bit. Um, there's, a, there's some spots. You got a little bit of chips that have been touched up. I don't know if you can pick those up in the video or not there. Um, and then there's one spot down on the side. And I'll kind of show you as I walk around it here. Um, the one down here that I did notice. And again, the car seems solid. It's just some issues with the paint or the paint's been touched up. That's kind of it for this side. I'll, when I get around to the other side, I know that there's there was a few more spots up here too, I guess. A couple of these little just spider webbing deals, if you kind of see a couple of those in there. Interior nice shape has been redone somewhere in the recent past with the cloth and vinyl combination. Um, headliner and everything, good shape on this one. Now, it also has uh, fender skirts with it. I do not have those on there in the video. I think with the wheel that's on this one, it's a nice looking wheel. Why cover it up? But uh, fender skirts will be put in the trunk and are included in the sale of this vehicle. Now, we do consider trades. Financing is available. And, of course, we can assist you with transportation to where you're located at. Slip around to the back of the rear bumper and bright work on the rear here. Nice shape. Once again, our phone number, 507-386-1726. And of course, the link down below in the description. Click on that. That'll take you to the still pictures at uniqueclassiccars.com. Let's look around to the driver's side. Don't remember anything major as far as paint or anything on this side. Now this is the last year of the first gen Bel Airs, 1954. I believe it was from 1950 to 54 that they made these. Let's go ahead and check out the interior. As you can see, the door card's also redone, retains a stock dash. And when I started up a little bit ago, I did notice that it appears that the gauges are all working. I have not had the radio working in this one. Uh, also, there is a uh, pusher fan on the radiator. On this one also to help with cooling. Let's go ahead and fire it up here. See how easy that starts. That inline six pops right over. I don't know if I can get where you can see the good oil pressure. Again, fuel gauge worked. Temperature uh, would come up with time. And of course, the battery gauge there. All appears to be working. There is an aftermarket stereo down below there. I've not had the stock one working. That's what I meant to say earlier. Go ahead and slip around to the back. A little rumble, kind of old school hot rod sound out of that inline six under there. I'd say this car is a nice driver quality car. I'm going to go ahead and pause this video, slip up to the front. Let's pause this video, pop the hood, check out what's underneath there. Have you take a look? 
All right, hood popped. Check out the engine bay. Pretty much what you'd expect out of a kind of a stock '54 Chevy. Inline six. Again, power steering. They said it did have a helper fan up here. See smooth running engine. There you have it, 1954 Chevrolet Bel Air. The original color would have came from Chevrolet. Phone number, once again, 507-386-1726. Down below this video in the description, there's a link. Click on it, uniqueclassiccars.com is the website will take you to if you want to check out the still pictures. Financing is available on the classics we sell. We can assist you with transportation where you're located at. Once again, phone number 507-386-1726. We also consider trades. Give us a call.